So, uh, how about the debate the other night ago, huh, Joey and Donnie? Oh, gosh, here we go. Shut up, Towers. I had a cold and was very sick that night. It just was a bad night overall. Ha, ha. You must have had the shortest cold in the history of mankind then. I'm an old man. What do you expect, fatty? We're all almost the same age, so I see where Joey is coming from. Don't count me in on that. I'm like 15 years younger than you senior citizens. I may be old, but at least I don't have the brain of a newborn like Joseph. I don't. Prove it to me. I'll be more than happy to prove it to you. Roll the clips. So let's get that straight. And they like you more than just about any And that's based on the <laughs> <laughs> and Secretary Cardona and uh, Mayor Bowser and Chancellor Farabee, you know, thank you for joining us as well. <laughs> hey, stop laughing and at me. Seriously, Joey? The country, what an idiot. You know, oh, come on. Those are edits and memes. Not fair. The amount of funny and random things people come up with are crazy. Which is why in this video we're going to react to memes from X, obviously Twitter, on the debate. So we get to laugh at Donnie for an entire video. Ha ha! Let's go! You Cretan, most of the debate memes were on you. So it's the exact opposite. I hate to say it, but Donnie is right. We'll all just have to wait and see as we react to the memes. But we're not only going to include the debate, but whatever else we found on Twitter about us, we're going to react to. So if you enjoy the video, drop a like and make sure you subscribe for more videos like this. And speaking of more videos like this, if you want us to do our own debate, comment down funny things you want us to debate over, and we'll include your comment in that video. It's not going to be a debate that's taken seriously, so please keep that in mind. And same with this video, none of this is to be taken seriously since it's all satire, so throw out reality for a second while watching this video. Now, can we talk about Joseph literally pooping his pants on live television on that debate stage? Because it's too much money. It's tremendous, and we saved our steel industries because it's too much money. It's tremendous, and we saved our steel industries. Uh, uh, uh. I can explain. What in tarnation, Joey? Oh, come on, Joe. You couldn't just wait to poop on commercial break? Ah, uh, th that's disgusting. Holy crap, Joey. To think that that wasn't the first time you crapped yourself on stage is insane. Oh, now we're just going to lie and make up rumors about me? It's, it's no rumor, Joey. It's what you actually did. Yeah, explain these two clips then, Joseph. I saw in him then the same character that I see in him today. And even though he has faced unimaginable tragedies. And so his is his diaper right now. His is undaunted. Uh. His strength is unshakable. His hope is undeterred. Why did you randomly squat, Joey? Yeah, what, what was that? How did no one notice? Shut up. Stop assuming I just poop everywhere I go. Clearly you do. Wherever is convenient for you, Joseph. This next clip is leaked footage of Joe taking a dump. <laughs> <laughs> that that is not me until i get real concrete evidence that you see poop dripping down my leg it's all fake news oh shut up you can't just take my line speaking of lines what the hell were you even trying to say right here joey move until we get the total ban on um, the, 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 the the total initiative relative to what we can do with more border patrol and more uh, asylum officers president trump uh, I really don't know what he said at the end of that sentence. I don't think he knows what he said either. Look. Ha ha! Donnie, you were a savage for saying that. Oh, cut me some slack. I was just really nervous that night. Shut up, loser. Stop making excuses. You're the sucker and you're the loser. Oh, yeah, you also called him that on live TV, too. And he told me, he said, I don't want to go in there because they're a bunch of losers and suckers. My son was not a loser, was not a sucker. You're the sucker. You're the loser. Was I wrong, though? Trump dump is a chump, a loser, and a sucker. Zip it, Joseph. You're the one that will always talk the talk, but never walk the walk. True, true, you're right. He can barely walk to begin with. Why is it that on a presidential debate, an important debate for the American people, both you and Donald mentioned playing golf? That was all Donnie. He started it. Look, when golf is involved, it's a very serious manner because I don't fuck around when it comes down to golfing. Yeah, we can tell because the time dedicated to childcare was only 22 seconds compared to golf, which was 56 seconds. Kind of crazy to me. Oh, wow. I, I didn't even realize that that's all Donnie's fault. I apologize on his behalf. That's fake news and disrespectful for you to do anything on my behalf. This video doesn't lie, Donnie. I told you before, I'm happy to play golf if you carry your own bag. Think you can do it? That's the biggest lie that he's a six handicap of all. I was an eight handicap. Yeah. Eight? Mm -hmm. But I have, you know, how many? How, how, I've how, seen how, you swing. I know you swing. Okay, let's, let's, let's not, not act like children. President Trump, we're going to. Let's run. not act like children. 
Do you want to specific? Are y'all niggas for real arguing about golf during a serious time in American history? Uh, yeah, so? Unfortunately, yes. Yes, we did. That's just insane to me. You know, in another life, I would have really liked playing golf with you, Joe, but you just have to mess everything up as you always do. How about we shoot some hoops instead? I'll break your ankles and smoke you in basketball since I have the skills like LeBron James. This nigga is capping out of his mind. I have to see it to believe it. You say you'll be breaking ankles, Joseph? More like you'll be breaking your own ankles, you skeleton! Hey! Now let's look at the next clip with Joseph and Jill. Yo, you did such a great job. You answered every question. You knew all the questions. And let me ask the crowd, what did Trump do? I did not lie. If anyone's a liar, it's your wife. Just look at her. She looks like Emperor Palpatine. The fuck did you just call my wife, you bitch? A liar and a Sith Lord. Don't you dare talk about my wife like that. Or else what? You think I'm scared of you? Guys, guys, just quit it. This is all just jokes and memes. Let them argue, George. It's free entertainment. I have the most wonderful and beautiful wife in the world because Jill is a whale-sai flawiwa. Huh? Dolph sandwich cream hamburger. What? Looks like someone forgot their latest firmware update. Do you need a minute to reboot, old man? Shut the hell up before I defumulus kadoodle. Can't you slip cunicorn? What? Is bro really malfunctioning? This wouldn't be the first time he malfunctioned. Look at this clip. Eligible for what I've been able to do with the, uh, with, with, with the COVID, excuse me, with um, dealing with everything we have to do with, uh, look, if we finally beat Medicare. Thank you, President uh, Biden, President Trump. Oh, come on, man. Why is every clip about me messing up? Well, where are the ones where this fat ass messed up? Stupid Donnie, Will Sadef Leger. You're what? Same. You can't find any clips of me being an illiterate moron because I'm not a malfunctioning robot like Joseph. A malfunctioning robot who likes caressing random strangers, especially of the darker tone. Yo, what the hell are you doing to my nigga Joey? You're a freak! You're so gross, Joey! <laughs> I, I, I can explain! You can't explain anything! You did what you did, and you're a weirdo for doing that! I, I just like this smooth skin. Um, I'm trying to get a better skincare routine going on, so I asked him what lotion and moisturizers he uses. Bullshit! You were caressing him like you wanted to suck his dick. Whoa, whoa! Now that's gay. I'm sorry, it won't happen again. All right, all right, I guess this video is more or less turning into roasting Joey, which is fair, but... Let's go back to the debate. Oh, that debate from last week. Ha <laughs> ha. That was really something else. You watched it too, George? Yeah, yeah of course. course. Oh, oh, do you, you mean, mean me or George? Or George? I, think I think he means you, George. George. Oh, is that a glitch in the Matrix? Bro, just let me speak. Yes, Abe and I watched the debate, and I don't think Joey blinked once during the entire debate. His mouth was stuck open half the time, like, can a doctor explain what's going on? Joseph was most likely constipated the entire time. Crap, how did you know? I tried pushing out the same poop during the entirety of the debate, and it didn't come out. Shut up, Joey. We didn't need to know that. Other George was right. Just look at this clip of Joey straight up not blinking. Just do what you want. There's a thing called Article 5. An attack on one is an attack on all. and required response. The idea, the idea. I can't think of a single major leader. Were you high on drugs or something, Joe? The faces you made during the entirety of the debate was the face when you get so high, you start getting scared. Wow. Even the first president of the United States is a presumptuous bitch. What the hell did you just call me, bro? He's not being presumptuous, Joe. You were definitely high out of your mind on something that night. Yeah, Joey, no normal person just doesn't blink for 30 seconds straight. Everyone watching this video right now has blinked over 100 times in the past seven minutes. Not only that, but bro looked like he was on one HP the entire time too. I'm convinced Joey is actually a skinwalker. I think you may be right, Donnie. And I'm convinced that you did 9-11. Holy crap, Joe, you didn't have to go there. Joey, just don't even go there. Now that's inappropriate. Says the one who nicknamed me Towers and calls me that every single day since our very first video. Video. Oh, hey, what's up, Towers? Shut up! What's up, Abe? Good timing you joined because we're clowning on Joe's performance from the debate. Oh, the debate? <laughs> I laughed so hard watching it that I shit myself. See? I'm not the only person who poops himself. Shut up, Abraham's pooping is justified unlike yours. Stop meat riding, Abe. You're legit a convicted felon with the morals of an alley cat. Didn't Joey tweet that out, too? Oh, yeah. I couldn't believe my eyes that that was a tweet from the president's Twitter account. Not only that. 
But did you see that bro also called out Donnie on Twitter saying he was a sucker and a loser? Oh yes, I saw that tweet and retweeted it too. It's quite unbelievable how America went to utter shit after our presidencies, huh, Abe? I know, right. Just imagine if we ran in today's century. Hell nah, that would be terrible. It's pretty crazy to think that we literally do have a convicted felon running for president, AKA you, Donnie. You're starting to sound like Joseph. He literally called me a convicted felon on live TV. If a Republican did that, they'd go to Thank jail. Thank you, President Trump. President Biden, I want to give you a minute. The only person on this stage is a convicted felon is the man I'm looking at right now. Was I wrong, though? Cut bro some slack. You should be a convicted felon, too, with what you've done for this country. And behind the scenes, sniffing your nose away on places and people your nose shouldn't be in or on. When I went into the future, I saw that he does become one. It's a matter of time before it happens. Damn it. I have to find someone and somewhere else to sniff. You only dig yourself in a deeper hole with all your lies, Joey. And name one thing that I lied about. I bet you won't find a single lie. You said that the Border Patrol endorsed you, but they literally tweeted out saying they don't endorse you. By the way, the Border Patrol endorsed me endorsed my position. Now, how do you explain that, Joey? Uh, uh, difficult salt, man. Yeah, I don't know. Bro literally got clowned on by the official Twitter account of the Border Patrol. That's definitely a first right there. And out of all people, it would be Joe. Joey, why don't you go and take a cognitive test like how Donnie did? I don't need one, George. Do you think I'm dumb or something? Yes. 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 Oh, okay. Now watch this clip. Well, I took two tests, cognitive tests. I aced them. Both of them, as you know, it's, we made it public. He took none. I'd like to see him take one, just one, a real easy one. Like go through the first five questions, he couldn't do it. But I took two cognitive tests. We knock on wood wherever we may have wood. I just won two club championships, not even senior, two regular club championships. To do that, you have to be quite smart and you have to be able to hit the ball a long way. And I do it. He doesn't do it. He can't hit a ball 50 yards. He challenged me to a golf match. He can't hit a ball 50 yards. Uh, I think I'm in very good shape. I feel that I'm... Thank you. President Biden? You can see he is six foot five and only 223 pounds, or 235 pounds. Well, you said 6'4", 200. Well, anyway, that's it. You're, anyway. I can hit a ball over 50 yards, you liar. No, you can't. I've literally seen your swing, Joseph, and every time you've swung your club, you break a bone. Oh, yeah, I've seen that happen, too. Yeah, I tried playing air hockey with him this one time, and he broke his wrist off of the first serve. Who breaks their wrist playing air hockey? Joseph's cognitive skills are as weak as his bones. We all know the reason why you don't take a cognitive test is because you're as dumb as a shoe rack. No, that's being a little too nice. He's as dumb as a sack of potatoes. Shut the hell up. My dad had an expression he used to tell me when I was a little Biden. He said, champ, it's not how many times you get knocked down, it's how quickly you get up. I know like millions of Americans know, when you get knocked down, you get back up. Oh, that was cringe. Why did you even tweet that? Not one single person on planet Earth felt motivated by that tweet. Not even a toddler. Ooh, that's harsh. If my dad was still here, he would put you all in your place. And that's a fact. Well, he isn't. But if he did that to me, I would put him back in his place, which is the graveyard. And that's a fact. Ha <laughs> ha. Jeez, bro got cooked. Damn, that burns. Ouch. Bruh, moment. Chat, am I cooked? Yeah, you are cooked, Joseph. And just so we don't overcook you, since we need you for the next video, that's going to wrap up us reacting to the debate. Wait, what? I just got here. I wish they did debates back in our day, Abe. I would have loved to debate with Benjamin Franklin or even John Adams. The next video we're going to do is our own debate. So leave down in the comments any funny thing you want us to debate about. And don't make fun of me. Anyways, it's time for member shout outs. Shout out to Countess of the Dark, Joshua O'Malley, Croyce, Gabe Dudas 2, Kyle Warwick, Matthew, Jaden McCaw, The Homelander, Adrian Keene, Basilisk, Cosmic Ferret, President's Discord fan, Leighton Hatch, Joshua Jackson, Donald the Big Mac Crusader, Brown Sugar, Regular Degular, Jolteon, 1864, Arapentidos I Convertidos, Alistair the Radio Demon, Alex Bradbury, Iceman 42, Alex Avondo, Lisa Baker, Wes Calloway, Randy Shannon, Gil the Metalhead, and Jeff Keys for being our wonderful channel members. More shout outs to Arnold Torres, Matthew Williams, Money Dynamic Matanya, Tech Destroyer, Latura Coleman, Jacob Randall, Ray the Awesome Dude, Andrew Jones, Blake DeWombat, Donald Trump, Alpha Diamond, Albert Muhir, Nostalgia Network, Bear Dozer, Will Zoller, The Roman Empire, Makoto 13, T06, and your average Dragon Ball Z fan for becoming our dope channel members. Even more shout outs to Camden, Maximilian Plays, Zarka, Hunter Thompson, The Mo Mechanic, Darth Vader versus Luke Skywalker, 
Scox, Quick Scope Cooper, Animations Guy, Winter SRF, Brandon Ayala, Amper Sandler, Omnilude, Dominic Comacy, and Dragon Ball D for becoming our great channel members. And finally, huge shout outs to V Ricochet, Mevins 2001, Fabian Moans, Jordan Arness, The Gilder 7111, Media Fan 50, and Spectre for being our fantastic channel members. Have a great day, and may Jesus Christ be with you. God bless you.